Hey guys, and welcome back to some more custom NPC. So as you can see, there is a battle going on. I've been testing this out um, for the past, I don't know, hour or so, trying to fix it and pretty much make it as even as possible. And I also TNT'd this area just to make it more of a battle scene kind of spot. But it just, this is really difficult. This is kind of one of the reasons why um, I haven't been doing full on battles yet because I can't figure out a way to make it perfectly even. Uh, the mob spawners are a good way to get things closer to being even, but a lot of the times they don't spawn in, like, um, I don't know if it's because it's in the light or what the deal is, but sometimes they spawn in a lot of people and sometimes they just, they don't spawn in any and it really messes up the spawn, like, I don't know, because sometimes it spawns like 10 over here and then they all die and then like they only goes one at a time so it's really confusing and uh like right now it's pretty even um okay exactly why it's not that never mind it's not even anymore but um i just need to get more spawners over here i guess but anyways i'm trying to get the battles to work and obviously i'm showing you what i've done so far and it is kind of difficult to get this working but Hopefully you guys don't mind seeing a few failed attempts. I'm just going to try to get this to be as perfect as possible. And, uh, because it used to be the files that were getting just demolished. And, uh, it's because I, like, put, their, their health was so low at first. So that was one reason why. But, um, see, now it's kind of even. It got back up to being even, and they're only lost by, what, three? So, I mean, it's not bad. It could be also the knockback that gets them, but the maples are way faster. Is that they're two percent faster? As you can tell, they do speed up quite um, quicker. They have a better acceleration and whatnot. But the point is, like the files also have a better range. But it it is pretty even when there's a decent amount on both sides. It's not like one is obviously overpowering the other. But, uh, the Maples definitely need more people on their side. So I'm going to keep spawning in some more. Hopefully it'll eventually even itself out. And once it does, then we'll be good to go. But this is going to be like the first little battle scene. And, uh, this is what it's going to look like. See, now it's kind of like the Maples are over. I don't know. Because I can't just spawn in 10 over here and 10 over here. Because that, um... Because for some reason when I do that, it just causes even more chaos. I feel like the mob spawners are what is the best way to do it. I don't know why it is because I'm not close to it. Like if I stood down here, it seems as though if I'm next to the mob spawners is when they only appear. See, that's weird. I shouldn't have to stand here. I don't know. And now are the fa yeah, now the files and now if I go over to the maples. Yep. That's the problem. That was the whole problem this whole time. So it's because I was closer to one side more than the other. So I have to like be in the middle. I literally have to be I have to make like a post up. Which I mean this isn't bad. As long as those ones start working. Oops. I just knocked down a whole bunch of stuff. <laughs> Oopsie. Okay, sorry about that. I had to fix it all up and whatnot. Okay, so that seems to be the problem, but now that <laughs> the maples are just demolishing. So now if I stand over here with more files, yeah. See, now the files are a bit stronger, though. They have better range stronger attacks but the maples are quicker and they seem to spawn at higher amount like if it's a group of maples you're screwed but if there's at least three files then they'll easily get two or so kills but now there's so many maples everywhere it's frustrating this is very frustrating i can delete some some of the maples here there we go See, this is pretty even right here. 
I just don't think there's going to be any possible way for me to get it fully even. It's just going to come down to the numbers of which they spawn at. But it is pretty cool that I can create something like this. I mean, I'm not like, I'm, you know, not liking any of it, but it's, it's just kind of frustrating when you try to do something and it doesn't seem to want to work. It's like, it's so close though. <clears throat> but yeah, there's so much to do. Hmm. Well, that's frustrating. But don't worry, I'm gonna keep showing you guys like little battle scenes that like right now it's perfect. It's perfect. This is what I would want to see. And I don't know, I don't it's just gonna be something to work on. But I've literally gone through like ten days trying to get that figured out and um Yeah, but that'll be always spawning now, they'll always be attacking. It'll be like the first little war, I guess, just a sneak attack. But anyways, um Hopefully you guys commented on who you wanted to be because I did look over the comments and a lot of people really wanted a dwarf couple to be in the In the town and whatnot. I thought that was really cool because the couple was like perfect I don't know if you guys saw last episode or anything, but um, It was pretty weird how Perfect they seem to be so I'll show you guys again and then I'll spawn in some new people and then we can get some work done in the hospital. I don't know how much work I'll get done today just because I was showing off that battle for most of the episode, but um, if you guys enjoyed the battle, be sure to tell me. I'll try to show as much as I can trying to figure out what'll make it work the best, so I'll do what I can. So there's Dax and there's Demi. Dax and Demi. The perfect dwarf couple. Now, where could I put them is the thing. <gasps> they can own the slaughterhouse. Perfect. All right. Dax. And Demi. Enjoy your new homes, everyone. Awesome, they get the slaughterhouse. <laughs> the cutest couple gets the most dangerous and evil building in the whole village. Perfect. That makes sense. Oh, yeah, and you guys remembered what the name was. It was Jack the Giant. That is so awesome that you guys remember that. I'm going to look at the comments real quick and uh, thank all the people that... Said Jax. I know a few people did, and it was really awesome. It really made my day. Okay, here we go. Let's see. There was the giant was called Jack. Been watching since the beginning. So Matt Jack plays is the guy that commented that, and then the Jack's giant's name was Jack. That was by Laura Wood, and let's see here. Everything else is picking Demi and Jack. It was Jack the Giant, and he had a gold carrot in his hand from Joe Wilson. Very first comment. Thank you so much for all that. Yes. Okay. I kind of remember what he looks like. Um, he was a human. He was... Oops, sorry. He had a... Uh, let's see. I, if I When I see it, I'll, I'll know. I just can't remember what it's called. I feel like it was this, almost, but it's not. Oops. There it is. That was it. That was it. Okay, and then he was like a... I don't think he was a 30. I'm going to go with 20 for right now. Oh my god, it's perfect. Hi. How about we put him to an 18? And we'll call him Jack the Giant. There we go. Oh, his name is on. See, how about a 16? I want to see his name is the thing. All right, good enough. And then we'll go like this. I think I had golden carrots in both hands or something. And how about we give him like a sword? And then he had a cape too, is what I remember. 
go. Texture of the cape was just uh, ragged. There we go. Um, actually, you know what? Let's put him back up to like 20. I think that was good enough. I think the 20 fits perfect. And yeah, you can see the name right there. And he also had a dragon on top of it. I don't remember the dragon's name, but at least we can get the dragon down. So, um, I don't even know if I named the dragon as that thing. Oh, that looks sick. And it was, pr I'm pretty sure it was the gray dragon. And I put it at like 10 or so. There we go. Perfect. We got Jack the Giant back. Awesome, 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 awesome. Okay, let's get the other characters in now, and you guys can vote on that. And then uh, we'll see how much time I have left to do on the hotel. Or the hospital, I mean. My bad. Okay. Three, two, one, stop, move, left click. Monster. Three, two, one, stop, move, left click. Oh, nice. Uh, I'm gonna call him Rift. Three, two, one, stop, move over. Okay. So we got Rift the Ghost. Very nice. And then three, two, one, stop. Three, two, one, stop, move over left. Elf male. Three, two, one, stop. Now I have one. Three, two, one, stop. Okay, I guess it's this guy. We'll call him Burp. No. And let's see. Three, two, one. I think if I do three, two, one, it's better. If I say stop, then I'll just keep going for some reason. Three, oops. Three, two, one. Oh, we got a crystal again. Wow, the crystals are getting quite popular. One, three, two, one. Ooh, that one is cool. We'll call this lit. Uh, now let's call it list. No, that's stupid. How about lits? Oh, that's good. Lits. All right, awesome. We got Rift the Ghost King. We got Burp the Elf Male. And we got Lits the Electric Cube. So vote on who you want to be in the next episode. And, um, yeah, I'll give you some seconds right now to vote. Just comments in, you know, down there, and I'll look at them. Um, uh, yeah. We got Rift, Burp, and Litz. I, we do, still don't have, a, a crystal in this game, I don't think. The closest thing is, like, Goal over there, who's the golden block. Nothing really else, though, so. Interesting, interesting. I think we should start getting some glass on here. That's kind of what, I need to get some windows and just, really it's not windows, it's glass. Okay, we'll do actual glass and not the window panes. I don't, I, the window panes are just such an annoyance to use half the time. So let's get this going. I did want this ho hospital to be like mostly glass, so I think what we're going to do today is pretty much add in all the glass that I want will be good because it'll give it more of a texture it'll make it look a lot cleaner and uh it'll get the walls finally finished because this is the walls have been unfinished for too long way way way, way too long there we go okay that's not a wall So this episode has kind of been full of all sorts of stuff. We got a returning giant. We got a battle scene. A little test battle scene again. And uh, we got some new characters. We got the, some of the hospital. We got just lots of everything. And uh, I think that's pretty... Kind of what I should aim for every episode is getting a little bit of everything. So it's not always... Um, so repetitive like oh this episode is going to be this and this episode is going to be this and then just back and forth between two areas because if i can keep those wars going and getting closer and closer actually being like doable then uh by all means i can 
get those rolling here because that, that's kind of like the whole point of creating the whole kingdom over there is just for the wars and all that good stuff so uh, I'll do my best to figure it out and yep we'll just see how it goes can't promise anything though because you know I have been trying to do some of these wars and they usually end up being a little bit messy so we'll see we'll see anyways I pretty much got all of this done it looks like oh I got this side to do and I got the lower section to do wonderful there we go but I'm really glad you guys are enjoying the vlogs too because those are like becoming pretty much one of my favorite things to upload now just I don't know it's really weird it's just one of those series that I am excited to have uploaded and for you guys to watch because I do put a lot of editing time into those vlogs even if they are short because like that last one that was eight minutes took me 20 or 30 minutes to uh, edit and um, the 18 minute vlog took me 30 to 45 minutes to edit and that's a lot of time that I usually don't spend on editing like it's crazy how weird it's just not it's a weird thing to edit because um, I'm usually recording I edit parts out that I don't want that like I know I don't want and then I upload it or render it then upload it right away but with the vlogs I literally have to look through everything because I can't have a mess up or like um, if Kenzie doesn't want a part of part of it in the vlog or if I don't want a part of it in the vlog I have to go to that spot and uh, yeah it's it's always it's like a kind of like a treasure hunt it's like I gotta find that one spot to get rid of or to add some words to it or music or all sorts of stuff and um, yeah I enjoy it quite a bit actually I just got, got to keep on working at it and hopefully they'll look a little more professional in the future because right now I can tell they're a little bit iffy with the whole professional look but um, I feel like I can once my editing gets a little bit more work I, they will look a lot better and I also need a new camera too I may be using a GoPro after I'm done with the flip video because the flip video is just very bulky and I don't like the way I, I have to hold it because I literally have to hold it so far away from my face it's it's just awkward and uh, I don't know I'm, I'll, I can deal with it I can deal with it I guess but um oops sorry about that Parking lot does not need windows. Okay, I'm just gonna put them right there. And uh, that really makes no sense into putting them <laughs> where the stone is, because then you can't really see through it anyways, so who knows. There we go. Perfect, nice. Yeah, it looks much better. Oh, that looks great. I just gotta do the floors in the next episode. All right, well, sadly, I, I'm running out of time here, so I'm gonna have to end it here, and I think next time I'm gonna be doing the floors here and try to get some more battle scene in it, too. But hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and if you did, be sure to leave those likes and comments. Vote on who wants to be to the next custom NPC episode. I'll show you guys the characters once again. And uh, subscribe and become a thief today, and I'll see you guys next time.